This is a step-by-step -step guide on how to buy NFTs from OpenSea.io. Hi, this is Mosh. I make finance and investing simple and easy to understand. Anything I learn, I teach you guys. So definitely give this channel a subscribe and give this video a like as it really does help. Today, we're looking into how to buy NFTs from OpenSea.io. So let's get straight into this. As you can see from the website, it says discover, collect, sell extraordinary NFTs. OpenSea is the world's first and largest NFT marketplace. It is basically like the eBay of NFTs. So if we go to explore and it gives you the most trending one, the ones at the top, you've got the board Ape Yacht Club. So if you go into some of these and some of these are ridiculous and you can see some of the prices that people are asking for the board Ape Yacht Club, um, 769 Ethereum, 740 Ethereum. And bear in mind, one Ethereum is around $3,100. So times that by 769. And that's how much they want for these. Some NFTs have gone ridiculous. The one I done my previous video about was a board bunny collection. In my previous video, I showed you exactly how to buy it. And this initial price was 0 0.4 Ethereum plus your gas fees. And you can see the current floor price is 1.28 Ethereum. So you would have more than doubled your money on these. So let's see the ones that are ending soon and see how much they're going for. So you can see this board bunny NFT is 2.49 Ethereum. That is a current highest bidded price and there's four minutes left. So from buying it from 0.4 Ethereum is now 2.49 Ethereum, which is equivalent to about $7,700. So you're more than doubled your money on this. So how do you buy an NFT? I'm going to show you exactly what you need to do. The first thing is you go to create. It gives you a selection of connecting your wallets. So they've got MetaMask, Coinbase Wallet, Wallet Connect, Formatic. Now, I think for UK and US, the most common users are Coinbase users. So there's two steps to this. And I'm going to show you exactly what you need to do. So you need to open up your Coinbase app. And remember, if you don't have Coinbase, you can get $10 worth of free Bitcoin, absolutely free. All you have to do is open up account, use my link in the description box below, buy at least a minimum of $100 worth of cryptocurrency and you get $10 free. All right, so once you're in the app, go to the top left and it's given your settings and it says get Coinbase wallet. You click on get Coinbase wallet, you download the wallet and it's a separate app you install. So the Coinbase app and the Coinbase wallet are two separate entities. Okay, so once you've downloaded it, create a new wallet accept pick your username so i'm going to put mosh money official because apparently it's not available all right set your private preferences so it can be a public wallet so other uh, wallet users can search for it username and send me crypto or you make it private i'm going to keep it public because it's a wallet it's almost like having a bank account okay use my fingerprint all right it gives you an option to back up your wallet all right let's do that later all right, and it gives you this option, a new way to buy and transfer from, so connect to Coinbase, to connect to my Coinbase account. Again, fingerprint, yep, let's connect to the finger, authorize. All right, now it says ready to transfer coins. So we can, congratulations, you can now easily transfer coins from Coinbase to your wallet. All right, let's transfer later. So this is our wallet. Now, if we go back to OpenSea.io and we want to connect our Coinbase wallet, I'm going to click on that. And there's two options. You can either do the Coinbase wallet extension or scan to connect. So open Coinbase wallet on your mobile phone and scan. So that is exactly what I'm going to do. And you can see this QR code scanner allow. It's right there. Okay, that is pretty slick actually. So it says signatures can be used to prove your own your wallet to allow transfer of uh, Asset transfers and other purposes. Only sign messages from D apps you trust. Sign. And it says it's from OpenSea. All right. So that is all connected. So that's my profile currently is as unnamed. I'm going to go to explore NFT. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to all NFTs. I'm just going to bid on one so you can see how it works. So let's go for this one it's called a goon cat i don't know what it is all right i'm gonna make an offer and i'm gonna offer 0 0.01 well, actually let's go less than that 0 0.01 ethereums okay and you can set a date and time for the offer to expire okay by checking this by agree 
make offer. All right, then it comes up with this. To make an offer, follow these steps. Deposit or convert funds. So I need to deposit funds into this account. So transfer funds from an exchange or another wallet to your wallet address below. Or the option is you can buy with card. If you want to do the buy with card and let's say you don't have Coinbase or Coinbase wallet or any other wallet, um, you, you, you're using something called MoonPay. So for example, the Ethereum price is £2,401. Now the actual price, let's do it in GBP of Ethereum, let's see if they're giving us the proper rates, is £2,323. So the Ethereum price they're quoting is £2,404. So you're actually losing quite a bit, I'm assuming, down to fees. So for every pound, you're getting 0 0.0146 Ethereum when really one pound should be 0 0.0043 Ethereum. And the minimum transaction is 30 pounds. Once you've transferred your crypto or deposited money using the card method, which I don't really recommend because the fees are expensive, the price they're quoting for the Ethereum price is ridiculous. So you're better off using a wallet and doing it that way. Then you can pretty much go around the website, bid on any NFTs or even buy any NFTs.